the boss bitch. Sleeping on me, gon' leave you exhausted. We sippin' Tito's. Pill Mr. Drink like she workin' Papitos. These bitches ain't fuckin' with me. Run to the bank, I keep a little duff with me. Ho got mosquitoes, titties. You bought the Vic, but I put the keys up in it. You blow my phone up. See me in person, bitch, you cannot hold up. What's up, you guys? I'm laying down right now. I'm about to get up. My ah, la, la. Ah, la, la. Shit, my mouth won't let me get the words out. But what's up, hoes? I'm laying down right now. I'm about to get ready to get up and take a shower and stuff to get my day started, even though it's like, what time is it? It's 3.38 in the afternoon. But I'm about to get ready to get up. So... I'm gonna bring y'all with me. First, I'm gonna clean my room up, the little room that I do got. I'm gonna clean my room up because it's a mess. Don't judge me. Because y'all rooms be fucked up too. And mass messed up. So, at least I'm cleaning it. And I won't get in the tub. So, let's go, hoes. Y'all, I tried to go get me a camera from uh, Best Buy, but they ain't even have them in stock. So, I had to order it. Well, I'm still trying to order now. My car keep declining, but we're gonna see when I get home. But I've been trying to, you know, buy me a damn camera because y'all want vlogs and y'all want to make it on YouTube. But I, I want a damn camera. I don't want to do everything from my phone because I want my stuff to be top tier. You know what I'm saying? I want everything to be top tier. So I'm headed home now to sit down and order this motherfucking camera for y'all. What's up, house? Um. This is my first little YouTube video, y'all. Mm -hmm. But I'm gonna eat for y'all. Y'all, I asked y'all on Instagram to like, give me some questions and things y'all want me to ask. So I said, I'm gonna eat my food while I answer these questions for y'all. Let me show y'all what I got. I got some BB curry bag, some barbecue. I got this grab, scrubs. Um, baked beans, potato salad, mm-hmm. And I got this load of potato. It's like some pulled pork on top of here. I don't fucking know. I don't need, let me, I'm gonna get my wrench. Let me get my wrench one second, give me one second. A little wrench in that was in this one. Okay. So it's, if you don't know, or if you're new to me, you don't you know who I am. My name is Samadi. I don't know, Marty, follow me on TikTok, Playboy Marty, Instagram. I'm gonna have everything at the bottom so you will see. But y'all, y'all know I just moved to Houston and stuff, so I'm trying to get settled in and see if I like it, because I don't know if I like it or not. Mm hmm. So, let me get into these questions, because y'all got a lot of fucking questions. And I ain't, can't, I ain't gonna do all the questions, because, bitch, I'm not time for that. Can I cook on you soon? I don't even know. I done got blocked on um, TikTok too many times. Be trying to get on YouTube and get blocked too. Do YouTube ban people? Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments, Shay. Y'all heard that? My first question I got, they asked me, how tall am I? I am 5'9". I probably don't look like I'm 5'9 on social media, but I'm 5'9". People be saying I'm tall, but I don't feel like 5'9 is tall, you know? 5'9 really short to me. Cause I feel like I'm short. Period. It's just how I feel. How your daddy react when he found out you was gay? Um... Me and my dad never had a conversation saying that I was gay. Like, we never talked. Like, when I was in eighth grade, that's when I stopped messing with my dad. Well, I, ooh. Baby, this is good in here. Wait a minute. Mm -hmm. When I was in eighth grade, he stopped fucking with me. Honestly, but my whole entire life, I already knew my dad didn't like me, and you know why he didn't like me because I was gay. So, 
to answer your question, he didn't even have to react because he wouldn't even be in my life. If you could change anything in your life, what would it be and how would you change it? Uh, if I could change anything in my life, one thing I would change was probably how, how I want to see it. One thing I would change was is one shit. Damn, what the hell I want to say? This rib tastes too damn good, bitch. I would change how I let people back in the day, not now, because you hoes ain't got me now, but how I let people take advantage of me. And I was living for other people and I was not living for myself. I would I had a time machine. If I had a time machine, I'd go back and change that because me letting people take, take advantage of me was like a downfall for me back in 2019. So. That would be something I would go back and change. Do you have any other jobs you want to do in the future? Yes. I, I want to be a lawyer. I don't know why. I want to be a lot of stuff. I want to be a lawyer because I'm already a private investigator. Girl. <laughs> I want to be a lawyer. I want to be a real estate agent. Yeah, and I want to be a content creator. So. Yeah. Remember your first fight? I honestly can't remember my first fight, honestly, y'all, because I had been, I've been in so many fights. I ain't seen I won all the fights. Because I didn't win all of them. But I've been in a couple fights. A couple. Like I said, I didn't win all of them. My first fight, I can remember. I got to fight with my ex-girlfriend when I was at the boys' girl club. I was had to be like eight or nine, seven or eight or nine. Her name was Lacey Linus. And I like, I can't remember why we were arguing. We was in like the, whatever room we was in. I don't know what the name was no more. It was so damn long ago. But she, cause she, she was a bully, really. Because she was a hard, she was from the wall. She was a hard body girl. She knew what, what's up. She was witty. And I really wasn't with it then. But I was a little timid. So she was doing all this talking. She was just talking, 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 talking. Just she going in on me. She was going in on me. So I stood up in my chair because she was a little taller than me at the time. So I stood up in my chair and I hit her about three times in the in the head, face, in this area. I said, "Wop, wop, wop, baby." When I gave that girl them wops, 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 that bitch snatched my ass off that damn chair, baby, and had me on my four legs like a dog and was riding me like a horse. Wop, wop, wop. And she got her legs back. So after that, I'm like, mm-mm. I ain't fighting this hoe no more. Her little hoe just told me you. That's my first fight I remember. How long were you in the military? Your MOS? I'm purely in and I hate it. I have been in the military going on five years. This is my last year. I get out next year, at the beginning of next year. My MOS is a 92 Alpha. Honestly, I don't like being in the military. And no, I'm not active duty. I'm National Guard, and I still don't like to be in it. I don't like it. I think I would have liked it better if it was active duty and not National Guard. You know? Yeah. What is your favorite color? My favorite color is pink and or black. Pink and or black. This potato salad better be taste like my grandma's shit. Cause I ain't no potato salad since my grandma passed away. Lord rest her soul. Lord rest her soul. She croaked over her bed and I ain't seen her since. Lord, mm. <sighs> for real. <clears throat> but she did croak over her bed and I ain't seen her since. But look at this potato salad. It better be good. Hmm. Look at that. I need to get a glass so I can really eat my food in peace. In peace, nigga. Oh, I can't say nigga. Too late. I blurred out. 
Can I try this potato chip I ask another question? I mean, it's because the low potato is good. Who gonna tell you how Y'all know they moving with them vampires on Disney Channel and like when the boy was trying to call a vampire, he was like this. I need to go watch that movie. Oh, Ooh, excuse me. It's not good though. I don't like that. Mm -mm. Has we ever did anything with a girl? Um, yes. I had this girlfriend back in the day, but I was trying to be a little shrike. <laughs> I had this girlfriend back in the day. Me and her still cool to this day. I still fuck with Jakaya. Her name was Jakaya. Mm -hmm. Her name was Jakaya. And at the time, she had big titties. Can I say that? Well, she had some big breasts, sis. sis. And like, we used to hunt. And she used to breastfeed me. Yeah. I was older than her, probably like one year or two. I think the Kylie graduated in 2018. I graduated in 2017. So it was like one year or two. But that was my little girlfriend. Mm -hmm. That was my little girlfriend. We ain't had no six seats, you know. Being it over Buster Wide type of seat. It was hunchy, because I liked it all. I was trying to act like I like a girl. How old was you when you lost your virginity? 16. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. It had to be 15 going on 16. Who taught you how to suck? What kind of shit is that? Who taught me how to suck? Well, <laughs> no, I just go watch the videos because I want to know how it happens, like how everybody do it. So, then one time, my, my uncle was babysitting us one time, and um, when I walked, I was in my friend's house for a long time, and when I walked in the house, they had porn playing on the TV. Yeah. They had porn playing on the TV. And he was like, I bet that made him hard. It didn't make me hard, huh? Cause I don't like girls. Cause if it was two boys, they probably would have, but it was two, it was girls and boy. I wasn't interested, so your joke was not funny. <laughs> In one word, how were your first time with both Jammers? Good and great. Good, great. I use the restroom in the middle of the night. When I'm on my truck and I have to use the restroom in the middle of the night, it really depends on what I have to do. Like, say for instance, I have to pee. I'm gonna get out and pee because at the end of the day, I still got a pee pee out there. So I'm gonna get out my truck and pee. But if I gotta do the number two, I don't like the shower. I mean, I don't like to use do number two in the bathroom with other people that they, they do number two in. So I, I got a lot of shower credits on my loves app. So I just, I just pay for a shower with my shower credit and go use the bathroom in the shower. It's a toilet in your little private shower. Not actually use the bathroom in the shower, baby. I had to clear myself up for you hoes think otherwise. I was growing up in Mississippi and what part of Mississippi am I from? I am from Canton, Mississippi, exit 119. I've been staying in Jackson, Mississippi for like two, three years, two, three, four years, and now I stay in Houston. Um, growing up in Mississippi was straight to me, it was cool. You know that people say there's a lot of racism in Mississippi. It may be. It may be a lot of racism, but I really haven't experienced that much racism in Mississippi. And I say this because I grew up in an all black neighborhood, so it wasn't no room for racism. The only thing that was racist is probably the police. That's about it. But I grew up in like an all black neighborhood, so all black schools. So I, I didn't really 
interact with people of different races. Hmm. Have you and your best friend ever had sex? No. I don't have sex with my best friend. This is my best friend. I know you fine. I know you fine. Y'all wanna have sex with him. But I don't wanna have sex with him. He's just a friend of mine. Where do I want to be in five years? In five years? In in five years, I would like to be, you know? Somewhere I'm living downtown and like a high rise apartment. I'm gonna own my own trucking company in five years. Um <clears throat> also in five years I want to, you know, be a full time country creator. Mm-hmm. I don't I don't wanna work, y'all. I hate to work. I'm one lazy helper. I hate the work. I hate the work. I hate, I quit. You know how you put a two week notice in? I don't know what that is, baby. I know what a one hour notice is, cause one hour. Two weeks for what? Two weeks for what? You know, give me two weeks one time for you to find me. You gonna say, bye. So what I'm giving you a two week notice for, girl, get out of here. You the bitch. How long did it take you to come become famous on TikTok? Honestly, about two days. Cause the first day I posted my first video, not my first video, but my first viral video, you could say, it blew up instantly. And I posted like two, three more, I kept going. And my followers, I ain't got, I had a got, I ain't got 100,000 followers in one day. And the next day, 200,000, next day, 300,000. And I had got, got up to 700,000 and that's when TikTok banned me. So I was off TikTok for like, Two weeks maybe I made another account and I got that up to 300,000 followers. And once I got up to my 300,000 followers, I got my other account back. So now, right now, um, I'm at 800, 890,000. So we on the road to a million. Go follow me on TikTok. <laughs> Who is someone that's in, that inspires you? Someone that inspires me. It's a couple people that inspires me. The first person I would say is my mom. Because with all eyes against her, she still succeeded. My mom got six damn children. She really didn't have no men helping her with her kids. She was doing everything on her own. And she didn't give up. She did not give up. My mom didn't have us living in no hood. My mom didn't have us looking any kind of way. She took care of all her children equally. To this day, she take, she would take care of us. That's why I love my mom. And that's what inspired me. She didn't let nothing stop her. Done with my Kyrian and my mukbang. I'm kind of tired now. I'm finna um, go to sleep. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on TikTok, Instagram, and she follow me on Facebook too while you ready. Twitter too. I'm gonna leave everything, what you call it, the caption down below or whatever down below. I'm gonna leave all this shit up. But peace out, hoes.